What's up guys, this is Stacy, and today I want to spend some time to show you how to uh, root, unlock, and flash clockwork mod recovery to the Transformer Prime. Uh, thanks to developer Viper Boy, we have the Viper Mod Prime Time tool, which will do uh, all of these things with virtually uh, one click for each uh, step. So, super easy, hands down the best way to do this right now. Um, and if you do everything correctly, it's pretty much fail-proof. Um, you can even uh, unroot uh, if you need to send your device in for service. So, uh, excellent and big uh, thumbs up to Viper Boy. Uh, we all appreciate this. Thank you. So, uh, the first thing we want to do is uh, download the, uh, the uh, Viper Mod Primetime zip file from the article and uh, extract that to your desktop. And once that's done, uh, we're going to go to the tablet itself and we got to make sure that, um, uh, well actually just before we get started, I already downloaded uh, Root Checker from um, the market just so I can show you guys uh, that uh, the device does not have root right now. So as you can see it says Sorry, this device does not have proper root access. So, we want to fix that. So what we need to do is go into settings and go to developer options and you want to make sure that USB debugging is selected. Uh, once you have that checked off, go up into uh, accounts in sync and you do not want uh, ASUS Sync to be checked. You want to make sure to disable that. And from there, go up into Apps, All, and if you have Splashtop in here, which you most likely do, I've already removed it, um, you click on that and uh, force uh, close that. Just hit Force Quit on uh, Splashtop. And also, if your device is docked into the keyboard, uh, you want to make sure you undock it for doing any of these steps. Okay, so now we'll go back to our desktop. And uh, you've already um, downloaded that zip file and extracted it to your uh, desktop. So you should have the Viper Mod Prime Time file and uh, within there contains everything that we need including the updated drivers so um, in order to install those you need to uh, hit the start button and go into the control panel and hardware and sound and then go up to the device manager and from here you're looking for portable devices so click on the little triangle to open it up and then you'll see Transformer Prime TF201. Uh, right click on that and hit update driver software. Uh, and then you're going to want to browse your computer and then uh, let me pick from a list of device drivers. And uh, at this window here if you don't see um, MTP USB device uh, you're going to have to uh, say that you have the disk and then um, from there search um, your desktop where you placed the the primetime uh, mod file and within there you'll see um, Android Win USB and so once you install that you should be able to communicate with your device so okay we'll uh, close out of here and then now we want to open up the tool itself so within the folder you will see Viper Mod Primetime 4.5 so if we open that guy and run it you'll get this screen here and this is where we're going to be doing everything right from here um, within this screen you'll see that you've got various options you can root uh, on any version of ICS um, even if you have the most recent update this will work and also if you haven't got any updates um, and you're still on honeycomb you can uh, 
still root your device and even this uh, will work for the original transformer so that's that's pretty cool too uh, you'll also notice you can unroot and then um, you can also uh, use the ASUS unlock tool while at the same time uh, flash clockwork mod recovery so first thing we want to do is um, we want to root the device and since I've got the most recent update from ASUS I want to hit uh, option one and uh, as soon as you hit enter it'll do its thing so I'll go ahead and do that now uh, hit any key to continue and again and there it goes installing BusyBox and now we've got our tablet is rebooting so we'll go ahead and let this reboot here for a moment and uh, we'll check to see if we now have root access and we should Okay, uh, like I said before, um, I already installed uh, root check and uh, titanium backup, both which are easy ways to tell if you have uh, root or also um, if you see the super user app um, under your apps, which I do have now. There's the super user. So let's also check root checker and verify root access get this zoomed in for you well, super user request will allow that and there you go congratulations the device has root access so uh, it doesn't get much easier than that um, okay now the next thing we want to do is we are going to unlock the device and uh, at the same time flash uh, clockwork mod recovery so that is option number five and hit enter press any key to continue now one more time it really does not take long to do any of this and it says we've got success okay so uh, please find the unlock tool in your app drawer and run it this device will reboot and unlock your bootloader loader. once your prime has fully rebooted please press enter to flash clockwork recovery so let's go into the tablet once again Go into the app drawer and we're looking for the unlock tool, which is right here unlock device. Right there. Go ahead and hit that. And then, of course, you've got the, uh, the, uh, the warning that Asus has. You know, obviously you're going to void your warranty and all that, um, but I guess uh, that's what we're here to do, so let's uh, hit OK. And upside down, sorry. Okay, so you're going to have to hit Agree again, and press to unlock. okay we're back I had to enter in my password and uh, wouldn't you know it unfortunately the camera ran out of memory and stopped recording so unfortunately you guys are gonna miss out on seeing the tablet reboot after I entered my password but really you didn't miss anything um, 
we're back to the home screen right after the reboot and we're going to continue on flashing clockwork recovery um, so uh, back to the Viper Mod Primetime tool you will see here on mine that it says install failed already exists well that's because I had to uh, go back into this you know because the camera stopped so I just wanted to show you how this works when you are ready to flash work uh, or flash the uh, recovery so uh, after unlock this is the screen you'll get it'll say press any key to continue uh, you just go ahead and press any key and it'll start flashing the recovery so we'll give this a few seconds to do its thing here and it's installed and rebooting and once it's rebooted uh, there's a different method to um, getting into recovery you power the device down and then you press uh, power and volume down for five seconds um, or I'm excuse me, you press power and volume down until you get to the ASUS screen and then you press volume up within five seconds so once we get rebooted here I'll show you how that works okay so just to show you guys that we have clockwork recovery we'll go ahead and power the device off Okay, and now we will hit pa uh, power and volume down at the same time. And then once we get into the ASUS screen, we're going to hit power up within five seconds. So, or volume up. So, we hit volume up. And there we go, we've got clockwork recovery. Uh, it's pretty easy process, pretty simple. Um, now you guys can go ahead and uh, make a backup. Um, it's also uh, uh, recommended to install OTA Root Keeper from the market just so you uh, don't lose root with any future updates from ASUS. So uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this and got your device uh, rooted, unlocked, and got recovery installed easily. So thanks for watching. This is Stacy with Talk Android.